Hey guys, welcome to me reacting to SML movie Jeffy's Whistle by SML. Now, I do not know what this video is going to be about. I'm just, I'm guessing Jeffy gets a whistle. Uh, judging by the thumbnail, I don't think it's going to be a video where Jeffy just gets a whistle and blows on it. And that's it. Because <laughs> that'd be very boring. <laughs> now, I wouldn't be surprised if that's a segment of the video where Jeffy just gets a whistle and then blows on it and then annoys the crap out of Mario. That's probably a segment, or I, I'm sorry, Marvin, as, as they say, you know, yeah. Uh, but yeah, I I feel like that's probably it, what I'm expecting from this. I don't know. Anything that happens that I'm not expecting, I'm not expecting, I guess, but I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm hoping this does something off the wall insane, because based on the thumbnail, it seems like it might do that. Which I'm hoping they do, but uh, yeah. Anyways, guys, reaching from the description, make sure to SML things. So let's just get right into it. Hey, Danny, what's for dinner? I don't know, Jeffy. Probably green beans or something healthy. Black on your plate. Black on the plate. This is a football. Picking something nasty for dinner. Automatic pizza party. We're not having a pizza party, Jeffy. Okay. Unnecessary yelling. Automatic. Don't have to go to school tomorrow. Oh, you have to go to school tomorrow. Do not blow that whistle. Unnecessary roughness. Automatic. Get to go to Disney World. We're not going to Disney World today. What? Oh, there's someone at the door. What's Somewhat the right. Okay. Uh, hello. Hey. But Goodman, what's wrong with you? What happened? Why do you look like that? Well, I decided to count all my money, so I withdrew a hundred million dollars in pennies. And I started counting it all. And I was staying awake for two months straight, and so to help keep me awake, I decided to hire a hundred women. And what they did was, they just walked around in circles as I was counting the money, and I gave them spankings to help keep me awake. So I was like, one dollar, uh, two dollars, uh, three dollars, uh, spankings. And, and so I wasn't getting any sleep, and so I decided to come here to see if I could stay with you. Wait, why, why would you want to sleep here? Why don't you just sleep at your mansion? Because if I stay in my house, then I'm going to want to keep counting my money. And then the girls are going to keep wanting spankings. Uh, okay. Uh, so I need to stay here, and I'll pay you $100,000 if I can stay here. You, you, you okay. Stay here for $100,000? Yes, me, whatever you want. Well, well hold on, because the only, the only thing I got to say about that is if I stay here, there can't be any noise at all. No banging. Okay, no so that's the problem with the whistle. No, no, no whistles? Yeah. No yelling? Nothing. Not a single sound, because if one thing wakes me up, no hundred thousand dollars. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. So that's what this is. No, no, okay. No, uh, no. Is that gonna be a problem? No, 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 no. Just give me about thirty seconds, and there'll be no noise. Uh, I don't have thirty seconds. I'm tired now. And I'm ready for bed. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Uh, go, go lay on the couch. Go, go lay on the couch. I want that hundred thousand dollars. There won't be any noise. I promise. <laughs> All right, buddy. You just lay right there, and I promise there won't be any noise. Okay. What's that? Uh, no, 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 nothing, nothing. I promise there won't be any noise. I want that hundred thousand uh, dollars. I'm gonna go stop that noise right now. Hold on, hold on. Okay. Jeffy, give it here! I said take the whistle from him. Was that so hard? I was trying to be nice. Oh, look, guys, I need you guys to be quiet. Cause look, Goodman is downstairs and he's really tired and he said that he can sleep here and no one makes any noise. So give me a hundred thousand dollars. A hundred thousand dollars? I need you to be quiet. Jeffy, I need you to be quiet. Just give it, give it, whistle. <laughs> He swallowed, of course he did. Uh oh. He swallowed the whistle. What? So now he can't stop the whistle, yeah. Let me fight, please. People, guys, I need you guys to be quiet. I need you guys. It's $100,000 downstairs. It... Please. No. Stop. Jerry. Please. No. Stop. Let me fight, please. No. Hey, please. Yeah. It's $100,000. Let's go outside and talk. Let's go outside. Let's just go outside. But it's cold outside. I don't care. Jeffy. Shh. Shh. Everyone. Shh. Jeffy. Let's go outside. Yes, yes, please, please, just close your mouth. Close it, close it. No, no, please! Oh, Jeffy, if you go outside, I'll get you a happy meal. Yes, yes. No, 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 no happy dance. No, stop it, be quiet, just close your mouth! Okay, is he still sleeping? Okay, good. Yes. Outside, 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 outside. All right, Jeffy, you can make as much noise as you want since we're outside. Just make noise over there. Marvin, you have to call a doctor. Why? Because he swallowed a whistle! Oh, he'll digest it and poop it out. A whistle? 
Hold on, I don't want to call a doctor, because then the doctor's going to want to come inside and make noise, and I don't want to wake up Goodman because I want $100,000. Well, then what are we supposed to do out here? Uh, go camping. You love outside, right? Camping, it looks Why don't like they just go to the hospital? Where? Uh, make one out they don't have to call a doctor. They could just go to the hospital. Jeffy wants a Happy Meal. Hey, Jeffy, you want a Happy Meal? Ooh, ooh, take Jeffy to McDonald's. Okay, can I take the car then? No, no, no. If you take the car, it'll start and make a loud noise and might wake up Goodman. Then how am I supposed to get there with Jeffy? Walk. With, you don't even have shoes on, so walk with your dirty feet. I am not walking all the way to McDonald's. Well, you're not going inside because you're going to make noise, so you guys are going to stay out here, okay? Move in! Okay, good. He's still sleeping. Okay, so Jeffy's outside. He can't make any more noise. I still get that $100,000. Oh, no, 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 this is the way, please. Why is the fire alarm going off? Ah, it's a fire! Oh, my God, was I doing? I know. Oh, okay. I was cooking beans. I was trying to cook dinner. Look, I don't know what happened. Put out the fire. Put it out. Well, I'm trying to. What, what, what's the noise? Why did you do that to begin with? Now the fire alarm's going off. You might have cost me $100,000. Wait, $100,000? Yes. Stop making fires. I'm trying to cook. Ooh, dang. I mean, he can't help it. Okay. He's that isn't... That isn't his fault. Oh, the doorbell, who's that? Will you stop with the doorbell? No, oh, sorry. I just really love the sound of doorbells, you know? I like how they go bing bong. Oh, no, please be quiet. Oh, dude, you should get one of those that's like da da da. Yeah. Da, 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 da. Be quiet, please. So this whole video is just basically like a Mario torture episode. Or sorry, Marvin torture episode. Also, I'm here to search your house for fire. Well, no, 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 look, look, there was a fire and I put it out. Are you sure? Because fires can be pretty sneaky. I'm sure. Because you, because you, because you, like, like, there's, there's a guy sleeping in there and he can't wake up. Well, he's sleeping in there? Well, he could have died in the fire. I'm surprised he didn't wake up when the fire alarm he just, He's just really tired. Look, look, there's no fire. You can leave. Wait, you know, I think I know what happened. I think maybe your fire alarm isn't working right. Maybe that's why he didn't wake up. No, no, it, it worked. have to drill into the ceiling and rip that out. Yeah. Cause a whole bunch of noise. So he's just so like, oh, don't make the noise, don't make, you know, just kind of like that. That's the basically the whole premise, I guess. All right, look for your stupid fire and then get out. Hmm, where are you, fire? Well, why would there be a fire under the blanket? Yeah, let's check under here. Why would there be a fire under him? Fire's pretty sneaky. You can creep up. That's actually kind of comical. Hold on, that's my phone. Decline it. Turn it off. Turn it off. That's my wife. Well, your wife. Well, you don't believe me? I'll put it on speaker. Hang up. Hang up. Hang up. Hey, Karen. Yeah. Yeah, I can hear you. What's up? Honey, I have a very important question to ask you. Please hang up. Please hang up. What is it, Karen? Boyd, what would you like for dinner? Corn dogs or toasted strudels? Hang up. I can't hear her. Now I gotta have her repeat it. No. Karen, Karen, what'd you say? I didn't catch that. What do you want for dinner? Corn dogs or toasted Yeah. I mean, Goodman's not gonna wake up. It's one of those, like, classic things where it's like, oh, the person hears so much noise and they don't wake up. Call your wife. Let me hang up on her. You're making a lot of noise. I, I, I can't have him waking up. Go back, go back to sleep. Go back to sleep. Oh, 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 oh. I, I, wouldn't a fire be in the kitchen? Hey, yeah, that's really good thinking. You know, you should be a firefighter. Uh, I'll, I'll look into it. Look, look, let's go in the kitchen and, and away from him. And be quiet, be quiet. Uh -huh. All right, look, there's no fire. You can leave. Are you sure? Because fire's pretty sneaky. You can get inside your walls and lay eggs like termites. It's fire! I'm guessing the fire's gonna be in there. There's no fire, so leave. Are you sure? Are you sure there's not a fire right behind this door? There isn't. Oh, yeah? Ah, ah! Get your fire! How about fire? I saw that coming from a mile away. Been in there for a few months. What will you do something about it? I'm gonna go fight that fire. What, fight it? Yeah, I'm a firefighter. We fight fire with our fists. What? All right, now you stay here. I'll call you if I need to tag you. Didn't Family Guy do a bit on that? Yeah. Are you okay? Yeah, I got him. Fight yeah, Family Guy did a bit like that. Oh, he got one good hit on me. I'll give him that. He put up a good fight. But who's still standing, huh? Huh? Oh. Me. Not him. Please be quiet. I'm an undefeated firefighter. 51 and 0. Shh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 51 and 0. Oh. <laughs> Anybody? It's actually not a bad line. You made a lot of noise in there. Oh, yeah? Well, you try fighting a fire with your bare hands and see how loud it is. That's harder than UFC. Oh, okay, look, look, look. The fire's gone. You can leave now. All right. I'm going to go home and eat toaster strudel. I'm going to ring your doorbell a couple times on the way out. Wait a minute, please stop. How is he still asleep? I'm not even going to question it. I still get my $100,000. Yeah, don't question it. The plot demands that. 
It's burned. What were you having a weenie roast? No, I was just cooking regular food and Gordon Ramsay's back. So sorry, but I could die. Well, it's too bad you didn't, because now you have to bear the shame of making this poison. Oh, look, look, give me another chance, please. Look, guys, 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 you guys are being really loud. Can you please just leave? There's someone sleeping in there. What the hell is this baldy? What is he, Chef Boy ID? Oh, look, guys, 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 uh, there's some wild beef Wellington outside. Ooh. Yeah, you guys can go outside, you guys, see, you guys see it. I need to check this out. All right, where is it so I can yell about how badly it's prepared? Yeah, I want to see. You guys are going to stay out there because you keep making too much noise. Oh, I did not. <sighs> oh, they're so loud. Okay, so he's just locking everybody out. No more noise tonight. There should be nothing else that'll make noise. Okay. So now it's just gonna be him making noises. I'm here. What? No, 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 no. Go, go, go back to sleep. That was literally the loudest sneeze I've ever heard in my entire life. No, no, no. It was. It was going wow. Somebody. No, come on. That was yeah. Wow. wow. Did you get your hundred thousand dollars, Marvin? Of course he didn't. I sneezed. <gasps> what? Jeffy, what? Did you just poop out the whistle? Um, let me check. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, this video was very predictable. It was very predictable, honestly. Even, even though I had no idea what the plot was based on at the beginning, like I had no idea. This literally was, well, yeah, as it went along, it was very predictable. It was very predictable. I, I even predicted the whole like fire behind the door and yeah, I mean, wow, oh, shocker, yeah. yeah. There are definitely people who didn't see that coming, to be fair. But I, I, sadly, I did. Honestly, it made it less enjoyable. This video was not really great. It was, as I said, it was very predictable. There were some lines here and there that were funny from Brooklyn Guy, but that was it. A lot of this episode was just a Mario Torture episode. And it was mainly just, yeah, that, oh, everybody's making a ton of noise when obviously they can't, you know, because Goodman. And then, of course, he locks everybody out. And then he starts making a ton of noise, and of course, the smallest of noise, like a sneeze, Mario, uh, Marvin sneezing, wakes Goodman up, of course, you know? Because, of course, that's funny, oh, really clever, guys, you know? Not predictable at all. It's just, this was not very good, not very enjoyable, and as I said multiple times, this was very predictable. That's really it, honestly. That's really all this episode is. It's just kind of filler, and it's not enjoyable because you can see everything coming from a mile away. It honestly just, it disappoints me. This wasn't terrible, like, it wasn't downright bad, but it was definitely not good. It was very mediocre at best, and at worst, it was bad. But at, then again, like, I this wasn't terrible, it wasn't very bad. Honestly, I'd give it a 4 out of 10. It was kind of bad. This was, this was not good at all. This was very bad. Uh, yeah. But yeah, anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the Viking Reader's channel, see you in the next one. Bye!